Hello, hello, hello here, Dr. Go Wild. Again, talking about different topics and science. Remember, guys, that we create and design this podcast to let everybody know about Harvard University and the magazine of Harvard Medical School. You can also visit our official website, which is magazine.hma.harvard.edu. You will be able to browse thousands of thousands of articles by issue or by topic. You will be asking Dr. Go Wild which topics do we have? Research, community, education, care delivery hours, and achievement. The title of the article to review today is The Power of Data, The Power of change. Biomedical scientists are reading a powerful wedge of change in how we conduct our research. Increasingly, biomedical science is being performed at the interface of wet laboratory experimentation and high-power computational and system approach. Artificial intelligence and machine learning algorithms are becoming indispensable tools for virtuality all forms of biomedical inquiry and are having profound effects on the practice of medicine. From Cambridge, Massachusetts at Harvard University Medical School, I want to remind to everybody that we do mostly the these beautiful reviews. I continue to stride the way doing it. This way of change has been building for decades. In 1999, for example, the NIH Biomedical Information Science and Technology Initiative note that researchers were spending less time in web laboratories gathering data and more time working in teams to harness the resources of computational technologies. Digital methodologies are initiative start, not just digital technology, are the hallmark of tomorrow biomedicine. In the Blavani Institute at Harvard Medical School, we have acted on this foreign side and are adding our own energy to the movement. We have a strong record of integrating quantity and computational approach in our research. In our department of biomedical informatics, teams of research are using data-driving approaches to better desired radiology imagines and better determine gen informed treatments for patients with diseases such as cancer. In the Department of System Mathematical biology researchers are drawing insight from math, physics, and computer science to illuminate the behavior of raw cells in cancer and infections. Our researchers in the Department of Healthcare Policy and Global Health and Social Medicine also are embracing computational tools. Their use of artificial intelligence and deep learning will one day result in tools that allow us to better analyze and for policy that will improve medicine and the delivery of healthcare. We are developing novel initiatives that will extend our explorations of computational science in biomedical research, for example, our new theory in biology fellows programs led by mathematicians and professors of system biology, Johan Paulson, will bring together physics and computational and data science, allowing their work to be a glue between different programs and different modes of intellectual inquiry, while our therapeutics initiative is emphasizing the use of technology platforms to support collaborative efforts among our scientists. are exciting times for research as communication technologies provide biomedical researchers with exciting and much needed new tools. All of us who are dedicated to discovering ways to improve of health of all people, stem disease and deliver care widely and equality should embrace the power these tools bring to our work. Alright guys, remember you can download this beautiful review from the magazine of Harvard Medical School. You can also visit the official website which is magazine that harvard.edu and these articles mostly of them have been published for the office of communications and external relations at harvard in cambridge massachusetts all right guys see you next time bye bye